thought he was someone else. Your stalker? I couldn't sleep last night. I kept thinking, what if he followed us to the hotel or broke into my house? He can break into your house? I thought stalkers only stalk. No, there was a stalker who lived in his victim's basement for two months. And then on their birthday, he set his victim's house on fire and this other stalker... Oh, wait, 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 he... wait, 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 wait. How come all of a sudden you know so much about stalkers? I couldn't sleep. I did research. I watched crime documentaries. Ah, that is not research. That is scaring yourself. Just want to know what I'm dealing with. If you want to be safe, don't go out alone. Look for someone to accompany you, like me or Alex. Or that Kepo Chandra. He's very free. Or Evelyn. She's very strong. I don't want to be a burden. Don't say that. We are your friends. Next time, don't paise. Just call us. Okay? Lunch is ready. Come on, eat. You skip breakfast. I'll be out soon. So, how does it feel to get your arm back? Like I'm one step closer to getting back in shape. I just wish it wasn't so hot. Why don't they have aircon here? My armpits are sweaty. Hello. You play sports, right? Sweaty armpits are part of life. I don't mind it when I'm playing, not when I'm relaxing. He's in the quiet nutmeg has aircon. Then go to the quiet nutmeg. Wah. And see Khadija again? <sighs> not after how rude she was to Mama. <laughs> Good. Better to stay away from that place. Especially since her boyfriend is also working there now. She got him a job there? Yeah. So that the two of them can be together all the time. Good, right? Ha! Huh. Dominique defended his mother after what she did. No wonder Geraldine dumped him. Ma, Shoko. How are you? I'm okay. Go. How come you're not in your shop? Cannot come back for lunch, is it? I have no appointments till later. Anthony is looking after the shop, so I came back. Hey, down. Why are you eating so slowly? She has no appetite. Leave her alone. No appetite? You are going to let that stupid boy make you feel miserable? Go. What? She wouldn't be like this if she listened to me and stay away from Li Yue and her son. Oh. What? You also eating very slowly, what? Hey, Geraldine, want to come to the spa with Evelyn and me? That sounds nice. No thanks. Cannot, no thanks. I booked already. Too late to cancel. Otherwise, they will deduct from my package. If she doesn't want to go, don't waste your time. I'll go. Hey. Your aunt made a police report. If you were the stalker, wouldn't you? Oh my god, this is getting worse by the minute. They're gonna find out what we did. They won't. Brendan's freaking out. Yeah, his parents are really super pissed about the whole shoplifting thing. If this comes out, he's going to be grounded for life. We all will. You got rid of the evidence, right? Yep, everything's gone. Look, this is driving me crazy. Let's come clean now. The longer we wait, the worse we're gonna look when they find out. They won't find out, okay? We keep our mouth shut, we're gonna keep cool, and this will blow over soon. I hope you're right. Hey, you're not going to say anything, right? I don't know. This is getting out of hand. So you're going to throw the rest of us under the bus? This wasn't even my idea in the first place. You dragged me along. That's not what your messages say. You read on us, and I'll post them on social media and let everyone decide who dragged who along. You wouldn't. Even if the police let you off with a warning, there will be a permanent record of what you did online. You don't want that, do you? Xiao Ku, huh? can you do me a favour? Sure. Can you return this to Dominic for me? Oh, are you sure this is what you want? 
The engagement is off. I don't know what else to do with it. You can sell it. Or not. Please, I don't think I can face him. Sure. But give it to me later, Ken. You know how my mind is. I scared I'll lose it. Adik, after clearing the tables, remember to wipe and sanitize the tables, okay? Oh, uh, thanks for the reminder, Kak. It's only your first week. <laughs> uh, look, it's easier if you do it like this. Sorry, Kak. I still can't get the hang of it. No need to be sorry. It's only your first week. You're doing fine. Once you're finished, you can go for your break, okay? I'll do it up. Mandy? You want some quaffles from the new bakery? For the first time, there's no queue. Oh. How much is it again? Seven bucks. Uh, it's okay. I'll pass. Thanks. Nah, for doing a good job. Continue. Hi, Tia. Eh, Christine. How's Jordan? Still down. Slowly getting better. At least you come out of her room for lunch. Poor girl. She really struggled with this. Wait. You knew she was dating the US son? Well, I... Uh... And you didn't tell me? I didn't think it was my place to tell. When will you stop hiding things from me? First Pa, now Geraldine. Just like Pa. Geraldine's an adult. She has a right to choose who she wants to tell. Just like Pa. She chose you, not me. I didn't tell my dad what you did to Auntie Rose. I'm waiting for you to tell her yourself. I can't. She'll kill me. Why did you even start it? She told my friends I was adopted. It's not a secret, is it? Yes, it was. To those people, I don't need their pity. They are your friends. They won't judge you. Everyone judges me, especially Auntie Rose. So you did all that to get back at Auntie Rose? Now there's a stalker. You put her and yourself in danger. Sarah, you have to tell Auntie Rose. I can't. You have to. In one week. Tell her in one week or I will. Wow. The massage so shocked. Yesterday when I do this to my shoulder, right, I can hear the crack crack sound, but now you hear nothing. Hmm. Geraldine, how was it? You feel more relaxed? Yeah, it was good. Massage and spa always works. Whenever I am stressed or upset, I will take a week leave and go to a spa. Confirm counting. It's not so simple. Of course it is. Geraldine, want to come again tomorrow? Uh, actually, maybe I should go back to work. You know, in a family business, it's really hard to take a break. You should take this chance to rest a bit longer. I don't think Gore can cope by himself. In the end, it will come back to me. Then again, maybe I just want to go home and sleep. Burying herself in work is another coping mechanism. I think I should buy a new bra, you know. Guess what? I booked us a car. A car? I figured we're in Germany, we might as well floor it down the Autobahn. You're still thinking about our trip? I know the past few days have been weird, but I'm not gonna let whoever this is take over my life. Or yours. Do you have enough winter clothes? Uh, no. I'm gonna transfuse some money, buy whatever you need for the trip. Thanks, Auntie Rose. Hey, so do you get your croffles? No way, so expensive. It's $8 now. No, no, no queue. Wow, what's happening these days? I was looking at stuff at AGM and everything was more expensive. They mean said prices are increasing everywhere, not just here. In fact, he says he's surprised that we haven't raised ours. Finished. So lucky, you only had to write your ABC and it's only one page. 
I also have to color the apple. Look at my homework. I have to finish all of it before mommy comes home. Wait till you're in primary one, then you'll start getting a lot of homework too. Every day? Yes, every day. You have no time to sleep or play. You just do homework, homework, and homework. Oh my toys. You can say goodbye to them. If I don't play with them, they'll be sad. I'll be sad. Then you make sure you get 100% for everything. Then your mommy and Akai likes might let you play. Do you get 100% for everything? No, that's why I have so much homework. Violet, time to go home. Back up. Do you think Sarah would prefer pink or blue? I'm giving her room a makeover. Hello? What are you doing? You have a stalker, you remember? Didn't you tell me not to scare myself, remember? Yeah, but aren't there more important things to think about than makeovers? Have you talked to your school principal yet? He said there will be a meeting but didn't confirm a date. Have you checked with the police for the updates on your case? I don't want to, OK? Because then I have to think about how I have a stalker or how I might lose my job. I'd rather choose pink colours and plan for my trip so I can pretend everything is fine. Have you tried spa and massage? And I think the blue one is better. Go, go! Did you know that every day, a human fat's enough to fill up a balloon? <laughs> Where did you learn that from? In science class. Gross, right? When Uncle Dominic comes, I also want to tell him. Hey, have you finished your homework? Yeah. Do you think I can play a computer game? You know that your mommy doesn't allow you to do that anymore. But how about this? Let's make smoothies. Hmm? You can put in anything you like. Okay. One of your friends is doing food delivery? Yeah. Looks like everyone's doing it. Yeah, I mean, it's easy to start and the schedule is flexible. So you can make money during your free time. That's true. Adi, what happened? Mandy, can you please... I'll get the first aid kit. Yeah. Nah, for us to share. Yeah. I fell down when I was coming back from lunch. Adi. Adi. Next time, you need to buy, okay? It's been a crazy few days and... You know Sarah, she doesn't open up to me. Has she said anything to you about the stalker? Anything? She wasn't really happy about how you told her friends she was adopted and stuff. Why? She doesn't want to be treated like a charity case. Oh, no. I didn't even think of that. Brendan, quit freaking out. If we get caught, the most we'll get is a warning. No, I read an article where these kids sent death threats to somebody online and had to go to court. If you don't believe me, I'll send you the link. Don't send it to me, I don't want to... Why not? Because you're as freaked out as I am. We won't get caught, okay? Mmm, not bad. What's that? Yeah, Coco and I make smoothies. You want to try? I put peanut butter inside. Shouldn't you be doing homework? Still have time to make smoothies? Tell your mommy, then you know. He's taking a break and he finished his homework already. Why can't he do his own thing? Do his own thing and get into trouble like last time? Nowadays, you must keep an eye on kids or they will make all kinds of mistakes. Coco, Daddy wants Mr. Ong's name card. In my bag. So when do they get to lead their own lives? Hmm? Or do you want to keep controlling them until they are 50? You get angry with me for what? I wasn't talking about you. But you think I made a mistake with Dominic, right? It was a mistake, what? Who asked you to date Liu san You know how I feel about her? Logo, enough. You think I purposely dated him to make you angry? It's not all about you, okay? When did I make it about me? You are too sensitive. Don't know why your Xiaogu took you to the spa to relax. Waste money. Oh, la, don't say it. Kuku, is this a real diamond? Does this mean Uncle Dominic is going to be my kuzang? Did 
Did I do something wrong? No, it wasn't you. See lah. See what Li Yue and her family have done to her. Girl. Girl. And I'm so, so sorry. I should have checked in with you before blabbing your whole life history. I hate that I ruined your birthday. Guess I Ravin told you. Don't get mad. Yeah, bygones. I'm glad you said that because I have a surprise for you. I'm thinking of a little room upgrade so you'll feel more at home. Why? Once my parents come back, I'll have to move out anyway. How is she? Still not talking. I know. My reaction was too big. But the whole of Singapore, she has to pick that boy with the silly bun on his head, Li Yue-san. She cannot control how she feels. She's how old already? You told me not to control her so much. And see now? I should have supervised her. Then we would have found out about that boy earlier. Not after they got engaged. You are so busy running the shop and checking on Anthony. Where is the time? From now on, I will make time. Maybe I shouldn't have nagged at her to get married. If I didn't put pressure on her, she might have told us about Dominic and asked for our advice. Never mind. From now on, we will watch her and make sure there's no secrets. Hey, where's my phone? You're joking. Your brother wants you to cancel the trip? Yeah, he just told me. Apparently there are complications and he doesn't have time for us anymore. But this is the first time you'll see Sarah in months. I know. I've got half a mind to go to Germany anyway. I don't think she can take another disappointment right now. So why don't you? Yeah. Forget about Jonathan. We can have fun by ourselves. Or you can just turn up, bang on his door and just barge in. I like that too. <laughs> Still don't want to sleep? You have school tomorrow. But I'm making a card for Google to cheer her up. She knows it was an accident, but a card is a good idea. Then she will know how much you care about her. Ten more minutes, then go to bed. Hey, mm. is Geraldine okay? I don't know. Still hiding in her room. They think it's hard enough, but falling for the son of your past one enemy, oh, short sure lot. I think it would take some time for her to get over this. <laughs> if it were me, I would put on my shortest dress and highest heels and look for another guy. She can't just forget, Dominic. There are other fish in the sea. If he doesn't treasure you, then forget about him and catch a better one. Simple. Father, why? Looking for my phone. Oh. Ah. Good night. Good night, Pa. Good night. Nah, I found this. Oh, one of our customers must have dropped it. You keep it. Eh, cannot. Which table was it at? Three. Oh, it must be the nurse that's always sits there. Next time, I'll return to her. Uh, no, uh, it was table seven. So, three or seven? Adi, where did you get this money from? From you. This is the money that I gave you? But you bought all those buns. How did you pay for them? I... I took them. You mean you stole them? Why didn't you just buy using the money I gave you? Because you don't have enough. Ka, you helped me so much. I just want to give you something back. When you were small, you liked it when I took snacks from the shop and gave it to you. Wait, did you fall like last time? Running away from the urn at the shop? Adi... You have to promise me that you won't steal anymore, okay? But we won't have enough money, Ka. Just leave it to me, okay? Did 
you enjoy dinner? The food was awesome, especially the lobster. I'm glad you liked it. Hey, how did you get that waiter to give us dessert for free? Oh, it's a secret trick code. What, some sort of hand signal? You tell the waiter at that restaurant that you love chocolate mm -hmm. and he'll give you a free cake. Oh, wow! How much free cake have I missed out on? Stick with me. I can get you lots of freebies. I need to get some hair conditioner. Give me a minute. Oh, sure. Thanks. My hair was going crazy without this. Hey, Auntie Rose. I was thinking maybe Germany isn't such a good idea. It's going to be super cold and I really would like German food. But I thought you'd be excited to see your... <sighs> your dad called you. He texted. It's fine. We can still go. You haven't been there. We'll have a great time, son's parents, if... That's what you want? You're letting me decide. Your opinion counts. <laughs> so darling, I'm here to stay. Don't really care what they say. Time will build up his family. Get through it all that comes our way. Won't let the day Violet, not eating? I have a tummy ache. Oh, where? Here? <laughs> Here? <laughs> it's because you're hungry. Eat something. I will stay home today. That's enough of this nonsense. Eat your breakfast and go to school. Fine. Then be hungry. But you're still going to school. Is she going to be okay? She'll be fine. You, on the other hand, really need a beauty sleep. 